as we mentioned at the top of the broadcast, Chief Justice Roberts had confirmed the death of Scalia and said at the time he was, quote, an extraordinary individual, jurist, admired and treasured by his colleagues. A fiery conservative, Scalia came to the court 30 years ago, appointed in 1986 by President Ronald Reagan. As a justice, Scalia was a leading advocate for a strict interpretation of the Constitution and known for his theatrical flair in the courtroom. His rigid conservatism and jabs directed at colleagues were well known. His sharply worded dissents and caustic attacks on liberal notions had an influence on a generation of young conservatives. He had a deep effect on the law. Born in Trenton, New Jersey, raised in Queens, the son of Italian immigrants was a high school valedictorian who studied at Georgetown University and got his law degree at Harvard. He issued thunderous dissents when the court upheld the right to abortion in 1992 and in 2003 when it struck down the laws that had targeted gays and lesbians. Scalia came under fire last December when he made controversial comments about an affirmative action case at the University of Texas at Austin. He said, there are those who contend that it does not benefit African Americans to get them into the, to the University of Texas where they do not do well, as opposed to a slower track school where they do well. What may have been his most important majority, in what may have been his most important majority opinion, Scalia spoke for the court in 2008, declaring for the first time that the Second Amendment gave Americans a right to own a gun for self-defense. He also played a key role in a series of 5-4 decisions that struck down campaign finance laws and said that all Americans, including corporations and unions, had a free speech right to spend their money on election ads.